welcome to Lords and Villains with me, Agent Lonergan. Now, it takes a little bit to get this game sort of started, so I've skipped ahead and got everything ready that I want to build. So we've got our farmland, which is over here flashing, and that's the uh, farmer's household there, the Giles there. They're the farmer Giles, so they're kind of cool. And then we have our oaken folds, who do the forestry and farming up here. No, just forestry, not farming, because farming is down here. This is forestry. I will get my facts right. <laughs> and this is their household there, the oaken fold household. And down here we've got our fishers, who I've called the Jonah household. Ha <laughs> ha, see what I did there? Yeah. Um, so they're going to be like our fishers and catching loads of fish for us. Then we've got the warehouse and I've put a few um, extra floor storage and barrels in there ready to go. And we've got my manor up here looking very mannerly for a manor. Yeah. So I'm going to start things off. And see what happens. I know we need a carpenter because I've assigned wood walls, so we're going to need a carpenter. So I need to do that, which is request family. I've got a hundred favor points, so it doesn't have to be super great. I can get like a level two with one generation. Come on, one generation. There we go. And where's the carpenter? Look for wood. Something that looks like wood. Um, no, that's a windmill. Rope making. Hunting. Foraging. Carpentry. There we are. And request a fan. Oh, there's not a one up here, is there? Milling. Farming. Glass making. Okay, right. They're going to arrive in just under two days. So whilst they're on the way, I may as well start getting a few bits ready for them. I think the other thing I need to do is just give some of these people bits and pieces so as they can start making their beds and things like that. So I'm going to do that, which is in the warehouse book, I think. It's been a long time since I played this. I I gave it a go in like one of the early betas and... um. I haven't played it since, but I've noticed on this one, there seems to be like a few new things. But for now, I'm going to grant Giles... They always want cloves for some reason after a bit of time, so we'll give them ten cloves. Um, we'll give them uh, 200 normal meals to tide them over, because I'm nice like that. Uh, what else have they got? They need wood. So if I give them... 30 wood and I'll give them 10 stone because I can't really spare much I know they need clay but they'll have to do without the clay for now uh, wax I can give them 5 I can give them 50 planks and I'll give them 200 straw and I think that'll do them. Right, so that's the Farmer Giles is done. Oaken Folds, what do you guys need? Well, we give them 200 normal meals. Uh, we'll give them the clothes as well. I think I'll do that for everyone. Uh, again, I'll give them 10 stone. Which doesn't seem to be coming off my um, tally there. Uh, wood, uh, 30. I think it was 30 I gave them last time, was it? Looks about right. If, I gave them, if it was like 50, 150 wood, then yeah, I'll, I'll grant them 30 wood. And 60 planks. And 200 straw. Awesome. Sorry, I have a cat sitting next to me and occasionally she, she needs like a fuss just to reassure her that she's um, 
not being ignored, as cats do. Let's give 30 wood to uh, the Jonas. Uh, 5 wax. 60 planks. Some straw. And because they're the fishers, we'll give them 25 yarn as well. Okay, I think that'll do for everybody. Okay, good. So they're sort of doing, putting out the farm land. Um, I have set it so they're planting pretty much anything they can plant, they're going to plant in there. So that should be interesting. Hopefully we'll get something there. Uh, the fishers, what are the fishers doing? They're just standing idly, like the way fishers do. When they're fishing, doing nothing. Okay, and what are you doing? Starting a wooden tower, I've got six planks. Why haven't you got your planks? Are you waiting for planks? Is that the planks? Uh, inventory? Yeah, ah, yeah, okay, they've got... She's carrying the planks. Okay, cool. So, that's good to know. So, the planks are arriving. Where are you going with the planks? Oh, come back here with the planks! Why did you put them there? Why, why would you put them there? That The house is here. Why put them over there in the middle of the beach? I, 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 I don't know. You know I, I just don't know. Okay, so what else is happening up here? They're planting trees. You guys are still... Oh, they've made their beds already, so that's good. They've got a place to sleep. Awesome. And what's going on up here? We've got a knight just casually just sitting around doing nothing. And I do believe that's me. No, that's not me. That's another servant. Okay. So where am I? Where's Lord Lonergan? Is that me? There I am. Lord Bob Lonergan, yes. Can't go wrong with the name Bob. I've always liked the name Bob. Okay, so you're cutting down trees and just flattening it out because I've got a dirt path for the flooring being made. What's that? Recently slept in bad conditions. Well, what do you expect? We're roughing it for a few days until our carpenter arrives and starts building walls. Speaking of, I need to build my carpenter's place of residence. So... Walls. Wooden wall. I'm going to try and do these episodes to about half an hour. In theory. Hopefully it'll work out. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. I could do like a massive square, but then I'll just end up deleting walls, and it can be a bit annoying sometimes. Ah, I pressed the wrong button there and just stopped my recording. <laughs> but I did do a really, really loud sneeze as well. That was just like... <sighs> Yeah, I could have woken the dead with that sneeze. If you're a dead person, that sneeze I just did, it would have woke you the heck up. <clears throat> okay, so we've got walls. I'm not sure how many people will be in that um, family, so I'll just plonk that there as well. I'll delete some of these walls in a moment. Another wooden wall. So let's go that way. I don't know what room that'll be. Possibly a dining area. Um, and we can have bedrooms that side, can't we? Yeah, that'll do. I guess. Um, just get rid of that. And that. Yep, 
Yeah. Um, wooden doors. One. Just rotate it if I can. There we are. I pressed the wrong key. So. All right. Yeah, actually, I've actually got a front and a back. I'd never noticed that before. How have I never noticed that before? Huh. I would do that then for that. Yeah. Huh. I never noticed that. How have I never noticed that? Well, maybe it's new, and I just never noticed that. Why did I have that paused? I don't believe I had that paused. That's weird. Everybody wants to build stuff, and I've got it paused like a crazy person. Okay, dirt paths. Let's just make a dirt floor. Once we start getting some wood, I'll replace it all with wood. But I find this is just a good thing to do, because it will clear like the trees and all that sort of stuff. So, what else is going on here? They're still sleeping. I suppose we could do um, a thatch roof. Because we've got plenty of straw. Yeah, I'll do that once the carpenter arrives, I think. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Okay, so it's night time and everybody's sleeping. Wakey, wakey, lemon bakey, or is it eggs and bakey? Eggs and bakey, why did I say lemon bakey? I mean, not that, you know, I'd, I'd never pass up a nice lemon bake, you know, they're, they're quite nice. Oh, just so as you guys know, we do have a graveside, um, yeah, because there's wolves over there, and they look kind of hungry, and maybe I should put a gate on the actual there, you know, I don't know. <coughs> On the bridge. I don't know if you can actually see my mouse pointer or not. I've got it turned off, so... Yeah, I, I was on about, like, the bridge here. Sorry for, for a gate. God, I sound awful today. But then again, this is the first bit of recording I've done in a bit of time. I'm always a bit... When I do, like, um, recording after a long time. Like I just... Like a person that's lost a plot, you know? I, I, same as every day, really. <coughs> Okay, well they're cracking ahead. They've sort of done wood stuff and built things. But we just need that carpenter. Um, so I can't zone it yet. I'll wait until the carpenter turns up to zone it. I'm going to need um, quarters for my, um, my servants, aren't I? So... How about... Well, I've got my bedroom in this area. I can put my kitchen and that in here, along with my dining table that I've already got set up. Bits and pieces in here. So I could put my servants in there, really, couldn't I? Have that as a servants area. Uh, zones. Uh, there we are. Zones. Uh... Household, would that be the one? No. What about a peasant? Peasants. Yes. My peasants. Ha ha ha. Clergy. Nobles. I'm sure there's one for like peasants. Well, they used to be not like peasants, but um, like servants' quarters. Unless it is essentials. Oh yeah, we need a caravan marketplace as well. And a normal marketplace. Slaver's kitchen. We could have a kitchen for the servants, I suppose. We can put that there. Manor. That's my place. Cottage. Ah, cottage. There we are. It's a living area dedicated to all of your servants. 
A few beds, walls and a warmth in winter is all I need. Right, okay. So, this is the cottage area, even though it's part of my manor. But, you know, I'm fine with that. And I'm going to give them a bit there as well. Actually, let's do that. And then they've got like this bit of storage as well. So we can go like that and then, sorry, go like that. Yeah. And... Yeah, time's still going, so that's good. Let's put in... What else do we need? A villa? Noble family, households, yeah, normals. Town hall. Building town hall. Yeah, okay, we won't worry about it just yet. So let's turn that off for a moment. Actually, let's put the cottage back on because then we can use the, um, like the helper thing to do some building. I'll build that. I want some drawers. A uh, wooden table and a wooden chair. Well, they don't want much, do they? Cool. Okay, well, I can have a wooden table and a wooden chair. I'm not going to give them loads of stuff because I can do that later. I might just like make the place a bit bigger for them. I just want the basics. Small shelves. Green. Food and beverages. Ah. Uh, ground deposit trees we can put outside. See, that makes perfect sense. Uh, a wooden block and a campfire. We can put the wooden block there and a campfire there. No, 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 no. There. Yeah. Okay, so that should be fairly okay. And they need a door. Another wooden door. Put that there. Okay, so that's their area. Right, the kitchen. We need a cauldron. I haven't filled in these corners because I'm going to be putting wood blocks there just to corner it off sort of thing. So it gets the extra corner. So it's like that. So there'll be a wood block there just to make the wood wall. Oh, smeg. Oh, that'd be alright. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Sorry, I'm just... Yeah. Um, a cooking table. Where was I? Yeah, cooking table. You can go there. Small shelves. They can sit there. Shelving can sit there. I may actually expand this area. A wooden block. A small barrel. I can't make the big barrels because we need our carpenter. And ground depository. Oh, okay. Let's do that anyway. I know where it is. It's here. Ground depository. One. Yeah, I'll just give one for that. Or two. Two. Yeah. But will that be in the way? No, I'm not happy with that. I'm going to take that one out. Okay. So we need some more storage for me, Lord Bob Lonergan. So let's put a chest there. And no, Bob is not my real name. It's just I like the name Bob. And I sort of wish Bob was my real name. But, you know, I've already changed my name once. I'm not going to change it again. In real life. Okay, shelves can sit there. Drawers. And a cabinet. Wow, this guy's going to have it all. I'm not going to do a rusty bookcase. Um, and we'll put a ground depository there as well. Yeah. And then I think over here... We can put stuff like the chopping block and things like that when I can find them. Come on, I know you're here somewhere. No, you're not here somewhere. Where are you? It's not furniture. Okay. I'll figure that one out later. <clears throat> so, 
What's everybody up to now? Looks like everybody's about to go sleepy boys. Let's zoom out a bit. And let them go to sleep. Aha! Looks like our carpenter may have arrived. Good timing. Yes. Austin Walker. Or Austin Walker. I might change his name later. I don't know yet. So now we can do some zoning for um, our walkers. So household. Which I'm going to actually do here. And here. And here. And then over here. And I'm going to put it out one more for outside storage, which I keep forgetting. I don't know how many are in the family yet. Walker. I was only two. That's okay. Looks like uh, Mr. and Mrs. Awesome. So, they can have their bedroom then up the top. Straw bed, nope. Double bed, come on. Let's press, oh, I'll give them a slightly different one there. There we go. That's more befitting of a carpenter. Um, uh, drawers. Ah, wrong, bee. Blah, blah, blah. wrong button and wrong words. Wow. Two for two. That was pretty bad. You'll have to... I, I have to apologise. I do have a problem with my uh, brain, for want of a better term. Um, and it affects my speech every now and again. And I can't help it. It just happens. And, um, yeah, when it does, I just go with the flow. Because there's not a lot I can do about it. Um, there's a well. Um, what else do we need? Cooking table. I've lost my place now on my brain. Um, press E. There we go. Come on, Lonergan. Get back on track. Small shelves. I actually prefer them this side for some reason. Because when you put them at the top, there's like that gap. And I don't like that gap. It, it annoys me. So I'm going to put it this side. It's just one of those things, you know? And shelves. See, look, the, the normal shelves, they don't have that gap. But that gap, it just annoys me. I'm sorry, game designers, but please, please, if, if you're going to do one thing, just fix the small shelves. There's no big gap behind them when I put them on the opposing wall. <clears throat> sorry, sorry. I'll, I'll back away now. Back away from the... Um, the uh, subject, um, yeah, there we go. We got those ground depository, yeah. Let's put a ground suppository there. Um, a chest, yeah, because we all, you know, everybody deserves a, a nice chest every now and again, you know. I mean, I'm a man, you know, I, I, um, I appreciate a good chest, I really do. Most men do. <clears throat> Um, I've really put that table in the wrong way. That's just that's just awful. That <laughs> that's, that's really awful. Um, yeah. Uh, chairs, chairs, chairs. I only need a wooden chair. I don't want to. I just want a wooden chair. I don't want a good wooden t chair, wooden table. Wooden chair, there we are. Okay, right. Let's make that a different colour. There we go. Have some dark wood. There we go. Could I put a chair that side? I don't know if I should or not. I'm going to put it there. If it's in the way of the chopping block, then I'll move it. I'm not too sure how it will work out, to be honest. Okay, zones. I didn't actually assign that zone, did I? I don't think. I just put it as household, so... This really needs to be Walker. And I always put in an extra one silver for the clergy. OK, 
Skywalker, you get over there and start doing your your thing. Um, I need another zone for a carpenter. Carpenter, bowyer, carpentry. Okay, so carpentry can be that area. And this will be for the walkers as well. And it's already set for the walkers. And I always put 1% on the clergy again as well. Because I just think it helps. Um... But to be honest, I've never got as far as actually having my own clergy. <laughs> okay, so we're going to need a builder's desk. Let's do the old Scrooge thing and have it against the wall. Yeah, there we go. Um, ground depository. One, two, three. We'll do three. A chest. Oh, we're going to need a storefront. Ah, oh, sir, I've got plenty of room. I think. Uh, let's get rid of one of these ground storages. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Production. Storefront, where are you? Are you at the top? Nip, 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 uh, storage. Oh, we definitely need a ground depository. No, I got rid of, no, 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 we want a chest. A chest. There we go, I have a chest. Oh, no, see, I've done it wrong. <coughs> okay, right, cancel you. Yeah, that, that's the weird noise I make when I do stuff wrong. Um, where are you? You're not decorations, you're not furniture, are you? Nope. you got to be here somewhere under production. What about essentials? Storefront, there we are. See, I'll get there in the end. Uh, let's rotate you. There we go. Can I pause that? Or are they just standing out? No, they're just standing still. Okay, cool. Um, oh yeah, I haven't given them anything to actually work with, have I? Um, so, let's grant the walkers. Um, I'll grant them 10 stone. 30 wood. 60 planks. 200 straw. And that'll do it, I think. And they're just going to sleep outside. Well, that's, that's fine. Everybody's sleeping outside at the moment until they start making some wood. Um, how much have we got over here? Have they started doing anything yet? They've got two planks, 28 firewood, 26 wood, and nine clay. Ooh, nine clay. Okay, so, if I be really mean now and just seize their wood. Oaken fold. Seize their 26 wood. Because I'm evil. But I did just give them like a load of free stuff. And then they can chop down some more trees and things like that. And they have been planting the trees as well, so that's good. Yeah, okay. And... Yeah, good morning to you too, Rooster. Okay, so they've been building doors and beds and stuff. You guys have been building beds and storage and stuff. And you've been doing the same... No one's really been building over here yet. Okay. 
I think I've got two guards, haven't I? What am I going to do with these guards? I don't know. I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll, I think we'll figure that one out next episode. What are we going to do with the guards? Yeah. Next episode's mystery. Yes. Okay, so I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. This has been the first installment of Lords and Villains with me, Agent Lonigan. Next time we'll figure out what to do with the knights and maybe get them around table. I don't know. <laughs> so until then, take care of yourself, and as always, I'll see you on the flip side.